I'm Stephen May and welcome to The Main Report. Now today I want to introduce you to a company called Timbercorp, Australia's largest promoter of so-called MIS investments in the agriculture and horticulture sectors. Timbercorp is Australia's biggest producer of tomatoes and olives and they're also a big player in citrus, mangoes, avocados, almonds, grapes, you name it, Timbercore is in it. Now everything about Timbercore is big, including its $860 million debt. There's also been a big fall in the share price over the last 18 months. Take a look at this. When a share price tanks, it usually leads to better debate at the AGM. Who can forget the cracking exchanges at the last HIH and Pasminko AGMs a few years back? And so it was this week with Timbercorp, where no less than 10 different shareholders got up and asked really good questions at the AGM. The board is to be congratulated for providing fulsome answers to most of the questions. For instance, have a listen to what CEO Robert Vance said when I asked about his personal financial situation. Um, I'd like to ask the Chief Executive if he has a margin loan over his 52 million uh, shares mm -hmm. and uh, whether that's coming into play at the current share prices. Well, the question is, do I have a margin loan? I do have a margin loan against uh, some of the shares I own, but it's far less than 10% and uh, I've got plenty of other assets I could use in respect to that if, uh, if that was necessary. Whilst most shareholders like me are doing their shirts on the Timbercorp share price, at least the board looked after us with the good old shareholder show bag. This is one of the best I've ever received. Starting off with a lovely bottle of bought estate olive oil. Now we really should be importing less Spanish and Italian olive oil and sticking with the great Timbercore product. Then you've got one for the salad. Some beautiful Roma tomatoes. Timbercore's got 40% of the glasshouse tomatoes market in Australia. It's huge. And then, if you're really interested in the olives, you can plant an olive tree of your own in the backyard, which is what I'll be doing. But the piece de resistance was this. A packet of Timbercorp wood chips. Now, the thing that I would have liked to receive in the shareholder show bag was 250 bucks of cash. Because that's what I've lost since paying $2.05 a share for 250 of these Timbercorp things in February 2007. Alas, I've blown my 250 and all I've got to show for it is a nice bunch of Timbercorp wood chips. Thanks very much Timbercorp. I'm Stephen Main. Just keep doing your best.